Now hopefully these things here will allow me to put some, uh, some oil in the beef trap. Guard bees bothering me. Yeah. So just wait on, I get guard bees bothering me. It hasn't calmed down. But no, he's still hanging around me. I'll have to back off a bit. hear me, the guard bee has uh, pushed me away. Now it's been very nice about it anyhow, but at some point it will get itself stung, get itself killed by stinging me. And the beetle trap there is because I have seen hive beetle here and uh, that's required as soon as you see hive beetle. Bang, don't they? Um, <laughs> no, nah, he's trying to he's trying to kill himself. Yeah. He's trying to kill himself in the basement. So, it just take a while, but this is good for them, because they get to know me. And, uh, you just have to watch on while this bee keeps flying around me. Making a lot of noise about it. Yeah, I can still hear him. He's still all over me. Uh, it's still here, you just have to enjoy watching that. The, the guard bee is being an immense jerk. And uh, it's taken a minute or two before he's backed off, so I've got to fill this uh, trap a bit here. These are beetle traps, and I've seen live beetle around, so in we go with the other beetle trap. And uh, about now. You can say that that's the only thing you can do. Whoa! You get upset again because the lid went on. <laughs> no, 
guys. Right, now they're not really upset with that, but the guard bee will be around somewhere. And uh, best get the lid back on. And be sure it's not askew. Oh geez, I hate this. It slides around a lot. One thing catches on another. There we go. It's got two beetle traps in it now. See a piece of